Remember, you know, there was this time I, I said, um, I thought you were cool, remember? Yeah, yeah, I remember. I lied. What? Not having a team can devastate a startup's abilities. Stay tuned, we're gonna find out why. <laughs> just a great product. A business is a lot more than just the product. What I'm trying to say is that if you have a great product, doesn't mean that the business is going to be successful. It's not always like that. I mean, yes, it goes without saying that you need a good product, you need a good idea, you need a good solution, but that's not all. A business is a lot more than just that. One of the critical factors that plays an important role in the success of a business is the team. And without a team, a startup's ability is crippled. A startup can only build an excellent product and the best sales and marketing machine only with the right team in place. The research shows us that a startup with a team is better positioned for success than a solo entrepreneur. Let's find out how a team can dramatically increase the performance of a startup. The first thing I want to say is that having a team is always better because it gets you a wider perspective. The greatest of all teams share and discuss all of the different ideas and thoughts they have. And that actually opens up your mind to a lot more things than just ideating by yourself and, and then deciding by yourself. Let's be honest. Sometimes, as an entrepreneur, you have shitty ideas. And having a team can let you know that. And not just that. Having different viewpoints can solve your problems and move your venture forward faster. Hey, Mithish, how are you? Hey, Jennifer, how's it going? All good. You tell me, what's up with you? Okay, listen, I have this uh, brilliant idea. Listen, okay. so I'm thinking for my next mm -hmm. YouTube video, mm -hmm. I should record myself dancing. And, and, and that'll prove a great point. Like good dancers are always great entrepreneurs. What do you think? Mm -hmm. Remember, you know, there was this time I, I said, um, I thought you were cool, remember? Yeah, yeah, I remember. I lied. What? Next. A team is always a great validator for investors. Investors love the team more than they love the product. VCs and angels, they, they, they want to know if you're actually serious about it or not. They, they want to know if their money is worth it. And the only way they're going to validate your startup is if you actually have a committed team. And number three, starved startups do not succeed. A startup gets twice or more resources by having a team. A single person running the company can only bring that much of resources. With two people, you get double the time. With two people, you get double the resources. The second person might bring along contacts, leads, and all of that is much more beneficial than the amount of money he's gonna take out of your company. It's amplified. And now my favorite point. At the end of the day, it's all about having more fun. Yes, that's right. You're not gonna have fun if you're alone doing everything by yourself. Even if you're successful, it's not gonna be fun. What's the point of doing it? I mean, which experience of life do we enjoy just by ourselves? Very few compared to the ones we enjoy with the loved ones. And that's what the team is there for. It's there with you when you win so that you can celebrate. And it's also there with you when you go through your tough times and lows. It's really important to have team for all of those reasons. And next, you stay committed longer. Yes, it's harder to give up. Yes, that's, that's the biggest benefit of having a team. 
I mean, if you're alone, you're only thinking about yourself. And sometimes you get lazy because of this. Sometimes you're tired and you don't want to continue because the only mind that controls the situation is yours. And to have confirmed that promise with a shareholder agreement in written. And finally, the show must go on. Yeah, that's right. If only one person handles the company, it's just too risky. It's obvious. Anything could go wrong with the person. He could have some health issues. He could have an accident. I mean, I don't want that. I'm not trying to offend anybody, but yeah, that's the truth. Anything can happen to the person. And if the person stops, the company stops. Having a team makes sure that doesn't happen. Because at the end of the day, the company is much more important than any single person. And remember, a great team can be successful even with an average idea. But a mediocre team will always fail, even with a brilliant idea. And for these reasons specifically, VCs and angel investors are always interested in your in-house muscle than the idea or the product. So if you're starting up with a plan to join incubators and accelerators or looking at VCs and private equity, make sure you have a team because nobody's going to be interested in you otherwise. It's just too risky for them. I'd like to ask you a question. Do you think a team is better than being a solo entrepreneur? Please share your thoughts with me, comment below, like the video and don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. See you until next week.